Hi all, hereby we are going to give a small demonstration with respect to ELSOM i500 module mounted on top of ELDB i500 development kit. So here we are going to give a facial recognition demonstration which we dedicatedly developed for our product. So talking about the importance of facial recognition, it is widely used in our day-to-day -day application which includes digital signage and then biometrics and banking purpose and industrial application. So moving on to the demonstration, I will be explaining how we have developed our APK for this particular application. So this application has been dedicatedly customized for our LDAS technologies only. Here we will be having the database of all the employees stored in this APK, so which in future will be developed as a attendance system. So direct based on the face detection it will give the attendance of the user where they need not to do any contact or contact kind of biometric attendance kind of system need not to be used so this will have the database of all the employees and whenever an unknown person enters so it will not allow the particular person to enter the premises as the access has been denied because this database is not stored in our application now let's have a look at the face facial recognition app you can see right now in front of camera, me and Alex, we both are standing and so even after slightest of our motion, the camera is able to detect our face because it is already stored in database. Now Alex is walking, there, walking through the way continuously and still the camera is able to detect him continuously. He is just walking, randomly he is walking, when after doing, even after the continuous motion also the camera is able to detect Alex's face. Now he is just trying to peek out. Even after peeking out, the camera is able to detect Alex face. This is all because the database is already stored with few members. That includes you and Alex. His name is also being stored after capturing few of his images and all. Then that models has been generated. Now I am going to demonstrate the sensor interface embedded in our development board. Basically we will be using I2C, SPI, UART and Bluetooth protocol to communicate with sensors mounted on top of different boards. Uh, in our development board, we have mounted a six axis sensor, which is accelerometer plus gyroscope. This will be really useful in VR application. So VR application, when I talk, we can take an example of virtual reality gaming, where this sensor will be mounted on top of the object, which can be car or a bike. Based on its motion, it will give the feedback to the main device. That can be our edge device. So it will do the complete analysis of that particular user's gaming and it will give the outcome, outcome how best he performed. And it will understand the user's uh, interest also. Based on that, it will predict and give a list of gaming which he is interested. So now I will demonstrate with an application how this accelerometer and gyroscope works. So here as I have installed few of the APKs, So see, whenever based on the angular motion, it will give the graph in respective x, y and z axis. So that is regarding with accelerometer. And uh, we have few more APKs installed in our board. So that can be like this I have already shown. So we are just trying to play this uh, accelerometer uh, and gyroscope with a uh, VR application which we have installed. So right now you can see in my HDMI screen that as per the orientation the images are moving that is like a kind of palace. So see now it will move to the other direction. So for your future requirement, we have extended our IO expansion connector also. There we have additional uh, spare interfaces which, which is like 11 GPIOs and there's two SPI, two I2C and two I2S interface. So basically this interface you can use to connect any sensor which can be on field or you just want to validate with your application that can be done with this IO expansion connector. See, uh, by default we have shown the remaining interface which includes HDMI monitor connected through HDMI port and Wi-Fi connected over the network, uh, dedicated Wi-Fi network and Bluetooth, Bluetooth connection and uh, other keypad and mouse connected to the USB port 
एंड कैमरा इंटरफेस ऑलरेडी शोन विद फेशियल रिकोगनाइजेशन एप नाइस पी डिस्प्ले इंटरफेस दैट इज बी एस आई विद टच पैड मोबाइल स्टैंडर्ड डिस्प्ले इंटरफेस